Three minutes per week we can ultrasound. Just for section. We can see the uterus. This is the uterus in transfer section. And this is the ovary. Left ovary measuring 3.6 by 2.6 centimeters and if you see there are one two follicles within it whereas the true transfer section of the uterus is this one this is the true transfer section that was to include the ovary with the uterus. Now the longitudinal section of the uterus shows in a 32 years paris female with empty urinary bladder the uterus measuring approximately 8.2 centimeters in length and 5.1 centimeter in anterior posterior diameter. This is the central ecogenic line of the endometrial canal. Endometrial canal is in very early proliferative phase, may use 4.3 and it is central and is uh, there are no evidence of any echoes or any ecology within the normal central clear endometrial canal. The cervix is normal. This is the cervical area. Now on the right adenexa, in the region of the right adenexa, we see uh, multi-separated complex mass. This is the outer surface, thin wall that measures approximately 9.5 cm by 9.3 cm. However, after surgical intervention, the size will be slightly more, is usually more than what we uh, measure by ultrasound. So I will take it as a cyst measuring 10 by 10 centimeters and here you see a tiny calcified area so it has internal uh, internal calcification this is the calcification and this sand like material within uh, the dependent region is are uh, the internal echoes Okay. And then these are the septa, these lines, this thick, this thick line is a complete septa, this is a septa, this is an incomplete thick septa, and these are all septa. So, and you can see why this is a cystic mass, that uh, there is strong posterior back wall, posterior wall acoustic enhancement is very much obvious in this uh, cystic mass. Now this is very much uh, relating to the left ovary, right ovary and is consistent with uh, a right tuberian mass of infective nature. This is the, I am trying to get, uh, get it with the uterus this mass. Now this is the uterus, anterior segment, fundal region. This is the fundus. This is the posterior wall. This is the endometrial canal. And this is the multi-separated cystic mass. See the posterior wall acoustic enhancement. And now I am giving it a transverse sweep to the probe and can see that it is, it lies in the 
region of the right adenexa and there is small amount of fluid. This is a fluid, small amount of fluid with echoes. This white area is suggestive of echoes. So these are echoes when the so there is a cystic mass in the region of the right adenexa with complete and incomplete thick uh, uh, thick septa with internal calcification and dependent region debris uh, with small amount of fluid in the pelvic cavity in a female age 32 years with a history of uh, constant pain in the uh, right uh, iliac fossa, right lower, right pelvic region and see the acoustic enhancement posterior to it, the wall is wall mayor of the cyst mayor 2.7 millimeters and the cyst retains its shape when I give a sweep to the probe. It does not change its shape. <laughs> This is the right tubo ovarian cystic mass of sonographically infective nature. These are the vessels. No regional adenopathy seen. So this is the case of the day.